Hello, in this video we are going to learn how to use the round function in Excel. Okay, we have five different examples and we will use round and somewhat similar functions like round up and round down. So let's start with the first example. Here this question asks us to find the nearest integer from this number. So we are just going to use our round function and select our number. For the number of digits, we are going to select zero for now because we don't want any decimals for this example. So it's round it to three. If it was higher than 3.5, let's say it was 3.6, it would round it to four. Okay, in the second example, we are going to use round function again, but this time we will use one decimal, right? like this one so we have 15.18 and we want it to be rounded to one decimal only so we write one here and it rounds it up because the nearest um, decimal is higher than 18 it rounds it up to 20 same applies to this one as well and in the third example we are going to use roundup whether it is close or uh, far away from the high number it just rounds it up so we write round up and select our example here sorry I have to choose number of digits so this time I choose zero digit you see it rounds it up to eight even if it was like 7.8 so it will round it up to 8 because this is the difference the round up from the round and the fourth example is very similar we just round it down and I will use zero digits again this in this example okay in the last example we are going to use the combination let's see what it wants from us asks us to use round function it asks us to use two decimals and we will use this table to write so let's write our round function and select the cells and two digits okay and I just copy and paste it like formulas it doesn't matter you can just paste it directly it rounds it to the two decimals for the whole range. So let's submit our answer and check if it's correct. Okay, good job. Thanks for watching and in the next video we are going to learn how to use the sum product function. So keep following.